Yo, what's going on everyone? It's your boy D-Lord and today, man, we're going to be talking about and playing college basketball revamped on NCAA Basketball 10. Now, this is available for the PS3 and PC. As of right now, I don't believe it's available on the Xbox 360, man. But just like they went through and revamped college football with NCAA Football 14, they did somewhat the same thing with NCAA Basketball 10. Now, this is still very, very early in the development cycle. So, all of the teams are not done yet, but a few teams are done. I just want to show you guys some of the stuff they have been working on. As usual, I will link all this stuff in the description so you guys can join the Discord and you guys can also check out and download the mod if you would like. So, the first thing you're going to notice is, of course, they have a brand new start menu. So, this is the start menu. This is what you're going to see when you have the mod successfully set up. All of that good stuff, man, which is pretty dope. You have Carmelo Anthony, Steph Curry, and of course, Kimball Walker, man. So, pretty cool to see right there that everything else from a presentation standpoint, pretty much the same. All right, guys, so when you're looking at the team selection, they did update the conferences. So, you see on the left, Louisville is in the ACC. They were, I believe, in the Big East when this game actually came out. So, they did update some of the teams and things like that, man, which is definitely, definitely cool to see. The AAC is in here as well they still have it as the atlantic sun but you'll be able to change it or they'll be able to change it as they continue to update it like i said it's still very very new they're still working on quite a few things man so we're just going to go ahead jump into a quick game uh, uva versus memphis so you guys can see you know it doesn't show the uniforms in the stadium but they do have the all new stadium for memphis man which is dope so you guys know the blue stadium that they have they have it in here, man. And it doesn't take that long to load. Look how long, how quick it loads on the PC. It doesn't take long at all, man. But right away, as we get into the game, you're going to see the new courts. And man, that's a beautiful looking court. If you ask me, I think that's a nice court. And I wouldn't mind playing there a lot, man. If you guys want to see some type of dynasty mode or something like that on the channel, definitely let me know. I'm still waiting for the rosters to be dropped. I'm still waiting on more teams to actually be added to the mod. But I wanted to show you guys quickly just a glimpse of how everything looks so we're gonna go past this just so you guys can see some of the gameplay um the game runs smooth there's really no issues no hiccups when you play i'm just not that good at the game as i press the wrong button right there i'm used to that being sprint but said that's the alley button but anyway man you see penny hardway so they do have the coaches in there as of right now he is the coach at memphis but like i said all of the teams are not done so they have to still work on that but you do see the uniforms i'm um, gonna see if we get a basket right here can he take it all the way? He cannot, man. So let's pause this. Let's take a look at the uniforms, man. Because like I said, they do have a few teams in here. Uh, we're not going to go through all of the teams. Just want to show you guys what is going on, man, and what they're doing to this game, which is which is dope, man. So you do see they did update the uniforms. Uh, obviously, the team, the players are not named. So the last names and stuff will be on the uniforms, you know, once we do that. They have Virginia's new uniforms as well with the new ACC logo. So that is dope. So they, the teams that they did, I think they did a pretty good job with them, man. Like I said, they just didn't do, you know, every team. But, man, look at, look at the court, man. Beautiful. All right, guys, so another court we're going to check out is the courts over there at Baylor, man. They redid this court. I think this court looks nice as well. Nice, clean, minimal design, but I like it. I like the light wood right there, man. It definitely, you know, brings out the green on the court. Of course, they have the new uniforms or the updated uniforms with Texas. You know, they don't really change the uniforms too, too much, man. They have the same with Baylor whenever we get a chance to actually look at Baylor's uniforms. Look at that court right there, man. Like I said... Looks really, really good. This game, if you have not played, it does have two different presentation types. So the first game you see in the CBS presentation, this game has the ESPN presentation. So they do go back and forth depending on what day you're playing, if you're playing in the tournament. But look at this court, man. I think they did a great job. It's beautiful. If you guys play the regular game, this is not the main court. So let's get a shot up real quick. Get an easy bucket, man. And um, let's, let's take a look at it. Let's take a look at this. Um, this is not, you know, a video for a bunch of gameplay, of course, man. But um, we do just want to kind of just look at what's going on and what they're doing. You see uniforms right there. The Big 12 logo is nice. Like I said before, the names will be on once they get the actual rosters. Um, there's, a, there's some type of placeholder roster, I believe. I just can't figure out how to get that to work. So this is what we're rocking with for right now. Uh, let's see if we get a different look. There we go. Maybe zoom in a little bit more. And there's Texas. So... 
the different uniforms are in there this is the closest you can get their replay system isn't that good in this game uh, i don't think it was built for you to get super super close to players but um that's what we have man but this baylor court this is also uh a1 to me all right guys so now we are moving on to las vegas man unlv and look at the court at thomas and mac man beautiful they have the the shadow of the strip on the court, which definitely does look nice. It could be a little overcrowded for some people. Me personally, I think it could be a little too crowded, but they did a heck of a job implementing this mod as well. You see the alternate uniforms for UNLV. You also see the alternate uniforms for Wichita State. So they're able to get both in there as we just kind of admire the stadium. Like I said earlier, the gameplay, it plays good. It plays really, really good. I haven't had any issues with the gameplay at all. So um, that is definitely a good sign. So everything does run smooth with this mod. And there we go, man. So they got Tarkanian Court out there, which is definitely dope. Man, these guys, like I said, they are, as we get blocked, they are working on something special, man. I think they're working on something special. Just like how this football revamp is something special. This game is something, is, is something special, man. I know college basketball isn't as popular as, you know, college football. Really, is a lot of um, other sports, you know, in the country, man. But it's just still cool to see. Somebody that does enjoy the game basketball, that does enjoy even the college, you know, basketball experience, man. I think this is really, really cool to see, man. We will go ahead and let them try to get a shot up if they're ever going to take one. Uh, this is terrible offense. You still, This is not on them. This is just uh, <laughs> the terrible AI that still exists in a lot of EA basketball games, man. I don't know what that was. As we just throw up a shot, we don't get it to go, man. Let's take a closer look like we've been doing at, of course, the uniforms. So let's go to this guy right here. He should be a little bit easier to, to lock on to. And you see, I hate their, um, their system of trying to get locked on to players. Like, come on, man. Look, we're trying to zoom in him. All right, let's go. So you see right there, Under Armour logo there. It's it's solid. I mean, I'm not too familiar with Wichita State's uniforms, but that looks solid. Uh, for UNLV, they got it. They got UNLV. They got the Rebels on the side. I like it, man. I like it a lot. So we want to go ahead, jump into the last game, which will be, you know, what the course look like in the NCAA tournament. And I'll probably end the video. All right, guys, so we are now at the NCAA tournament. So you see the presentation change once again. Now you still see the work in progress. I want to show you guys the good. I want to show you guys some of the bad. You see the background is yellow. Maybe, you know, they'll come up with a patch. At least I'm not aware of a patch currently, man, but I'm sure they'll definitely get this updated. They started working on this in April, so they haven't been working on this stuff long at all. But you do see the up dated court so i believe this is going to be the court that's used for the entire tournament i don't think it will change when you get to the national championship or anything like that i think this is literally what you have man but it's cool to see man it's still cool to see you see the updated jerseys for duke you see the updated uniforms uh, for ucla with the under armor um deal and all that stuff you got to fix the yellow background but like when you're in the game it's not that distracting at least you know i play on broadcast cam so it's not that distracting from up here um maybe if you had another angle it could be more distracting but um but once again you guys know the you guys know the deal man let's go ahead zoom out so we can see kind of what's going on here but with duke uh you do see the new the new logo for the acc underneath the american flag looks good that definitely looks good and then when you get to ucla you see is that their logo right there? That could be it. Yeah, that's the Pac-12 logo underneath. Uh, look like maybe a sponsorship logo. And then you have Under Armour, man. So, like I said, it's a lot of this stuff to me, man, is definitely impressive. It's definitely impressive. Um, I hope, you know, this catches on just like a lot of, you know, the college basketball mod caught on. But this is a very good, uh, very good mod. Still early, still very, very early in the process. It may take them some months, you know, to get all of the teams, maybe even a year to get all of the teams, all of the courts. But, you know, for, for fans that just miss college sports, don't have any college sports, I mean, this is our outlet. What these guys are doing, is truly amazing. This is the outlet, man, for the college football revamped and now college basketball revamp, man. If you guys want to see any videos on this, if you guys want to see anything with this game, let me know in the comment section below. As usual, man, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, please do me a big favor. Please go ahead and leave this video a like. It helps me out a lot. And subscribe if you haven't already.
It's your boy D. Lloyd. I'm see y'all next time. Peace.